Good evening. My name is Mary Carter. I'm with Pima Association of Governments. We are the Metropolitan Planning Organization for Pima County. We deal with regional issues like air, water, and transportation and the 2020 census. We have a regional approach and we have a plan and we have a calendar. If you look at the timeline, we are currently in the process of trying to get people educated about what is the census and why do we do it. We conduct a census because it is the law. It's Article 1, Section 2 of the U.S. Constitution that says, Thou shall count every living person every 10 years. That count will dictate and provide information that allows for representation in government. Arizona is predicted to have grown by 10% and we hopefully will gain an additional congressional seat. Additionally, funding is allocated based on population. It is estimated that each person counted is worth $1,979. There is a lot of media and a lot of airtime about a particular question, which we can't go into because it is still in litigation. But at the end of the day, this is about our community, my community, this region. It is critically important that everybody self responds. It is important that people understand that they can do this electronically, by phone in 53 languages, and by hard copy. The most important question is how many people live at each address? We have um, a lot of our residents who are here uh, you know, October to April. Uh, how, how do they? choose where they is they physically need to be here when they take when they do the census or how, how does that work excellent question it's defined by um, where you spend most of your time it doesn't matter if someone is documented it could be a canadian who is spending their time in oral valley if they are here most of the time they get counted here mm -hmm. 